So Soundster provides music recognition technology to real world businesses which license music. We help those businesses understand what songs are being performed or broadcast in their establishment and with which performing rights organization those songs are registered to. That data can then help that business negotiate fair license fees based on their actual music use. Prior to founding Soundster, I was a professional musician. I was the drummer and co-founder and co-songwriter of the platinum selling rock band Hawthorne Heights. And I did that professionally for 10 years. And it was uh, along my journey that I realized that I wasn't receiving my songwriter share every time my music was either being performed by ourselves or someone else or broadcast in, in a venue or a bar or a nightclub. That frustrated me incredibly. Uh, I contacted my performing rights organization and I said, hey, what are you doing to track all this different music? Here I have a, an app on my phone that allows me to just magically identify the music that I hear in this bar or this nightclub. Why aren't you using this technology for my benefit? So uh, I figured, why not do it myself? So uh, we uh, applied to the brandery and that provided me with the necessary seed funding to bridge the gap from my touring income to being an established company. It also gave me uh, the knowledge and skill set that I needed to really build a scalable business. There's a lot of analogs between being in a successful band and, and building your product or you know, recording and releasing it and everything that goes along with building a company, but there's also a lot of nuance. So the brandery provided that skill set for me, provided mentorship and tapped me into all the different investors around the area and around the world. Since I started Soundster, the startup ecosystem in Ohio has absolutely exploded. So it's, it's really exciting to witness that change come about. I think people are taking a much harder look at starting a business in Ohio because your costs are substantially lower than they would be on the coast, which means you have to raise is less money, which raising less money is uh, a dream come true because that's a full-time occupation in and of itself and when you're trying to start a business, the last thing you want to do is divert your attention from building your product and building your company. So uh, those are some huge key benefits and strengths to starting a business here in Ohio, I think.